Hey YouTube, it's Andy Frank here and today I have a two package mail day from Blowout Cards. I've been looking forward to getting this. Um, I can assure you there's some pretty awesome stuff in here. So let's go ahead and we'll open, I'll open this one first. If you can see, there's actually one big box and one smaller box. So we'll open this smaller box first. These will be uh, stuff opening up on future videos. I'm probably going to take my sweet time opening these because I had to save up some cash to get this stuff. So, so I don't want to just burn through it too quick. Alright, so as you can see, awesome. Star Wars Rogue One Hobby Box. Oh, didn't know if I would ever get another one of these, but I did have to pay a pretty decent price to get this, but it was well worth it. So, Star Wars Rogue One. We got a Star Wars High Tech Hobby Box. This is 2016. I've never opened these before, so that one will be a lot of fun to open. Got this for a really good price. We've got, I've opened these before Star Wars Rogue One Mission Briefing. Um, gotten okay hits out of them, but I'd love to get something really cool. And I got this really cheap. Let me get that thing to stand up. And Dick Daddy, my first ever Star Wars Masterwork hobby box. These these were super 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 expensive when they first came out. The really amazing stuff you can get out of this. As you can see, look for on card autograph sketch cards and authentic stamp relics. It's got like four little mini boxes inside this main box. I'm going to try to pick up one more of these because right now you can get these for just like really low prices. Like I don't see them dropping any lower than they are right now. They might, but I just I just can't believe it how, how cheap you can get these. And as far as the quality, it's like upper echelon quality Star Wars stuff. So my first ever one of those. Now for the big box. Oh, got stuff falling over here. Mr. Rogue One back there. High tech. And mission briefing. If you can notice, I there is a little theme here. I am um, getting a lot of Star Wars stuff right now. Trying to pick up some autos and like, sketch cards. For my collection and right now you can get Star Wars stuff pretty cheap so that's another reason why I didn't get Star Wars. Okay, so now this box. A very awesome, well oh, let me just so you can actually see, a hobby box of 2016 Bowman's Best. That is going to be very fun to open. Four autographs in this, in this, and they're all on card. Um, a lot of really good young prospects in this set. And we've got a hobby box of Panini Elite Extra Edition, also known as Triple E. Um, as you can see, look for eight autographs and two memorabilia cards per box. So this one's chock full of stuff. Um, this year's um, Elite Extra Edition is really cool. So that'll be a lot of fun. I have a hobby box of that. We got some Ultra Pro and top loaders. I was running one of those. Here. 
we have awesome Star Wars The Force Awakens Series 2. Um, looking for something better than what I got the last time I got this. Um, there's some really good autos you can get out of this and cool sketch cards. Hoping to get something awesome. Set that right there. course I don't just collect um, sports cards I also um, collect um, Pokemon cards me and um, my nephew junior we like Pokemon cards and I always try to pick up the latest booster boxes I got the the uh, Sun and Moon booster box from Pokemon I don't open those though just put them away and always get two so there's a second one See, there's going to be some really cool openings coming up, and I may not be done picking up stuff before I start opening. We've got two Pokemon Sun and Moons, Masterworks, we've got Journey to the Force Awakens, some Walking Dead back there. Mr. M sent me a beautiful leaf draft medal 2016. There goes the stuff. Uh, Star Wars High Tech, um, of unbelievable i was able to get one more box of rogue one and then mission briefing and then i've never opened either of these two hobby boxes bowman's best and panini triple e and these are 2016 so you're going to want to stay tuned for some really cool stuff getting open and um thanks for watching thanks for sub subscribing stay tuned